In today's video, we are going to talk about how to create a work lens project. First, open work lens and go to the project section located at the top next to home. Then go to the create a project section. Here, you can click the arrow to create a project using a template. We will cover templates in another video. After clicking create a project, a drawer will open. In this drawer, you can name your project. You can choose a color for the project and select whether the project is proposed, ongoing, or planned. I will select Proposed. Next, you can select the health of your project, such as Needs Attention, At Risk, or Good. I will choose Good. Note that you can change this after creating the project. You can set a category for your project. If you have pre-built categories, you can use them, or you can create a new one. If you need to add a note about your project, you can use the provided space. After that, you can enter the name of the client for whom you are creating the project. Then, you can select the project manager. You can also choose the start date and end date of your project. The default working days will be displayed, but you can change them if necessary. You can specify the number of man days and the time allocated per day for this project. Finally, click the Create button and your project will be created. Here, you can see your project name and category. You can also view your To Do, Doing, Done and Task lists. You can see the project where you created the task. When you left click on it, you can see your created task in the to-do task list like this. By clicking on this arrow, you can see the subtasks created under that main task. Then from here, you can select the team to add to complete your task. From here, you can select your task as a to-do, a doing, etc. When you select this task as doing, it moves to the doing task list like this. When you finish this task, you can mark it as done. It moves to the done task list like this. Go to a task you created in a work lens project and open the task. Then you can see the time log tag here. Click it. Then you can see a timer like this. When you start doing this task, click this button. Then you can see that the timer starts to count. Then when you finish this task, you can stop the timer like this. Then you can see how much time you have spent on this task. If you want to start and finish this task at a specific time without using the timer, here is how you can set up your time log manually. Also, if there is any important note, you can add it. Then click the log time button. In addition, you can log your time without opening this time log using the timer icon in the task tag itself. Here like this. When you go to the reporting section at the top of the screen and click the time reports icon, then the admin can see and analyze the time you have logged. Here it is like this. So thank you very much.